Hey guys, welcome back to another video. <laughs> so today I did this senior portrait look because I take my senior portraits today. And yeah, I did a tutorial on eyeshadow, but I didn't do a tutorial on my face makeup because I already did a whole nother video on that. Link above. Anyways, you want to see how I got this look? Just keep on watching. Hey guys, so my face looks horrible. Like it's a huge ooh, breakout right here. Ugh. Chin breaking out right here. So we need to fix this because this is not cute. This is what we're doing. We are preparing right now. This is just the prep for my senior portraits. I take them Thursday. Right now, I'm about to do my skincare. And then I'm going to wash my brushes. I use the Clean and Clear Morning Burst Facial Scrub. So far, well, this is my first time. Not my first time trying it, but this is my first time buying it. It's not bad. I like it. But I think I like the pink grapefruit. Um, exfoliator from Neutrogena more and after I do this my this exfoliator I take the Freeman um cucumber and pink salt clay mask I love this mask this really makes your pimples shrink like it really do right like it's just so good sorry if you hear me like I don't know why I think I'm getting sick or something it's an allergy like at Walmart they got like the travel size but the big old two you can get it from Ulta and I'm about to try one of these masks. I think I'm going to do the whitening one. Also, I got this from my dentist. This is Tretinoin gel. I don't know how to pronounce that, but basically, if you put this on your pimples, it will really make them, like, shrink. But it's very drying, so it, it basically dried them out. To check out right now. I don't know what time it is. Probably 12 something a.m. So if it is, then it's the day of. But it's night time. I don't even know. But here's a update on the pimple. I didn't do the um clay mask again today because I forgot. But I did put my um my prescribed gel on it, so it better be shrinking. And these are very less noticeable, so so basically, I blow dried it or I washed it. Okay, so I'm gonna start by taking the ColourPop No Filter Concealer in the shade Deep Dark 52, and I just place that on my eyelids and I'm priming it and blending it out with a brush. Then I'm taking the shade Spice from the It's Memory Ray Beige Cosmetics palette, the first one. This one sadly got discontinued. Sorry, guys. And I'm just packing that all in my crease. I'm using the ColourPop E9 brush. So after that, I'm taking another brown shade that's darker than that. The shade Mousse from the same palette. And I'm just using that to deepen up the crease using the same brush because it's just really easy. You know? Yeah. After that, we're taking a darker brown called Midnight, I think. Moonlight? I don't remember. I can't read. It's too small. But we just tapping at the outer parts of the eye to deepen up the outer V. And we're just taking the other brush, the color part brush, to blend that out. And next, we're cutting the crease. When you cut your crease, you want to try not to go too high and just cover up the eyeshadow that you just did. That's what I did by mistake because it's honestly been a minute since I cut my crease or did any type of eyeshadow. But, obviously, add more concealer if you need it. That's what I did. And now I'm going to take the shade Spice again in the ColourPop E1 brush. And just go over top of where I messed up. Because I took my concealer up too high. And I'm just pressing that back in to make the blend more seamless. Now I'm taking the shade Nudism or Nudist from the same palette. And just pressing that all over the 
concealer except for the part that's closest to the the dark the outer V because I wanted to make it easier to blend the dark brown shadow to the light nude shadow and it which it did so it makes the blend more seamless if you leave it wet and here I'm trying to really carve out my crease so it looks more defined with the dark brown shade from earlier next I'm taking this highlighter from Lori Geller it's the golden one I forgot what it's called <laughs> but it's the golden one everybody talk about it but I'm just taking that and pressing that over top of the pale shade on my lid just to give it some shimmer and now I'm doing eyeliner using the Maybelline Masterline eyeliner I think I like it's really black really good if you need an eyeliner from the drugstore and I'm doing the wing. Now I'm using Lily Lashes in Mink Miami. I know Mink. I know Animal Cruelty. Sorry. <laughs> my bad. But here's just a clip to me putting them on. These are my favorite lashes. But I see why people would be angry because they aren't cruelty free. She makes cruelty free. I just got the Mink ones. My bad. But yeah. When you're applying your lashes, make sure if you get glue on your eyelashes, on your real eyelashes, you, you take it off so it doesn't dry and clump them together. And here's how they look on. I'm over here doing minor adjustments, making sure the end and the inner part are stuck on and ready just for me. Alright, and now I'm doing my face. Okay, um, so here's a speed up of how what happened with my hair. So basically, the person you see doing my hair right now is the girl Jasmine. And she wand curled my hair last night and she pinned the, cur the curls up. So when I slapped, and now she took it up and she's taking out all the bobby pins. And then she's just fixing, adding little touches to the curls just to make them frame my face more. Teasing them a little bit with the comb. That's basically what she's doing. I think the hair, I think I look way better with curly hair. Because, I don't know, with straight hair, I don't think it's for me. I think we, I look way better with curly hair. Like, I was looking at myself in the camera like, oh. Anyways, then I was just doing my edges. I use an eco style of gel and a baby toothbrush. Okay, guys, so this is how my face looks after coming back from school. is right now. It's 3.19. And I went to school at like 9. No, no, I went to school at 8.50 something, so my school start at 7.50, so I missed first period, but it's okay, it's okay. Anyways, this is how my face looks. Obviously, my lipstick wore off when I was eating lunch, but I just put on some lip gloss because I forgot to bring my powder. It's even over here. See, that's why I forgot to bring my powder, right? And then it I thought I was gonna get rained on too from the rain. Yeah, my eyeshadow is still holding up. It's not even creasing. Let me zoom out in more. It's not creasing. It looks really good. I got a lot of compliments today. Yeah, I really like the curls too. This is my first time seeing myself with curly hair. And I really like it. I think my eyebrows turned out really good today too. Like, they never turn out this good. And I was having problems with the eyeshadow at first. Because this eye looked more professional than this eye. But the lashes just take away the attention. No creasing. Usually I have some lines about my smile lines. But no creasing because I said it really good. Other than that, the pictures went great. A lot of people kept looking at me in my face. Yo, my Spanish teacher ain't even recognized me. I walked in, she's like, you know how they greet people. They were like, hola. And I'm like, hola. She just like. And I'm like. Trying to walk to my seat. <laughs> she's like, Jonah. I was like, see. <laughs> She's like, I look so different. Yeah. It's called catfishes. Just get with it. 
Anyways, that's all I have to say. This is a recap of what happened today. Anyways, when I get the pictures, they'll definitely be at the end. You already know. Period. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below for more just like it. Yeah, I'm about to be a senior. Look at these curls on. You are <laughs> But yeah, if you guys recreate this, please tag me on Instagram. My Instagram is at J O N A A Y Y. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.